Hi, I'm Connor Leslie, and thanks for watching Hollywire. Hey, Hollywire. We're hanging out with Connor Leslie. Hi. Hi. <laughs> you do photography. Yes. I was checking it out, and it's really beautiful. Thank you. What motivates you? What are you? It's more like street. Yeah, I started doing street photography as like really just a hobby, and I live in New York City, so it's just easy for me to put my camera on and, and go. Mainly, I'm just always trying to find something a little bit candid and natural in a world that's very posed and, and mm -hmm. strategized around that. So, um, but yeah, it's a lot of street photography and just strangers and people. Yeah. Cool. Okay, so yay, you're a part of the DC yeah. universe. Yeah. Yeah. What was it like getting that phone call and someone saying that you're Wonder Girl? It was it was really like a shock because it happened so quickly between the time that I auditioned and like got that call. Um, and I was a bit overwhelmed for a minute because I know how passionate fans are about these characters. Mm -hmm. So I had a moment where I was like, this is really cool, but like <laughs> Hold on a second. Did you almost think to yourself, like, should I not do this? Yeah, people I are did. so dedicated. I to actually, these when I when it came to me, I was like, I don't know if I want to do that. Like, I was not like, yes, I'm gonna audition him again. I uh, I found I saw the audition. And I I remember talking about. It, I was like, I don't think this is something I want to do right now because mm -hmm. I was a bit nervous about the reaction because we know that they can fans are very passionate about their the characters they love. So it definitely was something I almost didn't do. What do you love most about Wonder Girl and what do you love most about Don Troy? I love the duality of them as like two separate characters but as like one whole because I think what Donna Troy does well is, and especially we'll see this in our show, is that she's able to have a reign on both. Um, Wonder Girl is this persona. Wonder Girl is, you know, an Amazon. She's got her, you know, all the incredible things we've come to see as, as Wonder Girl, but Donna Troy identifies as like, this is who I am as a person, not what I am. Um, and I think that's really incredible for women too. It's yeah. like, we can be more than one thing. And yeah. I think that in our show, like Dick kind of comes to Donna because he's her best friend and he's seeking, a, he's trying to figure out how she navigated this new life for herself as being able to be Donna Troy and leave the suit, suit behind, so to speak. And um, she's like, well, I just did it because I can do a lot being Donna Troy. Like, I can do more good being this person. I don't have to, like, lose sight of, like, who that Wonder Girl is. And so Wonder Girl's an extension of who Donna Troy is in a costume, but she's just as much Wonder Girl as Donna Troy, which I think is pretty great. Yeah. yeah. Cool. Okay, we're going to play a quick game. Guys, we are going to play Holly Words with Connor. Okay. That was a good spin. That was a solid spin. That was. <laughs> Guilty pleasure. Where do I start? <laughs> um, I don't know. For some reason, my mind went to food. Like, I, but I don't think those are guilty pleasures. Those are just like I like chocolate. I and feel like, like it can be if like you're like all I eat are Lucky Charms or something. Lucky Charms or Captain Crunch. Captain Crunch is my go-to. Captain Crunch to the point where it like r rips up your mouth. <laughs> you know, yeah, it, it does, does that right? all the, the time. I'll like you like, and I'll do this thing where I'll be like, I've only got a little bit more milk, so obviously just gonna put it <laughs> some more cereal in. I'm like, not too much cereal, so then the cycle just yeah. continues. I like my classic Captain Crunch. Solid spins. I know. Mmm, this is an interesting introvert or extrovert. I used to think I was an introvert. Mm -hmm. But I'm a little bit of both. Like part of me likes is a grandma and wants to stay at home on a Friday night with my tea and like stay inside. <laughs> but the other part of me wants to be in every corner of the world and like get out. So I think I'm a weird hybrid. Like I'm not clubbing. Cool. <laughs> like I'm, you're not gonna find me out Friday, Saturday night, you know, yeah. doing that. But um, I'm a weird hybrid of, of both, I think. You're a, a traveling bit. extrovert. Yeah. Totally. That's that's there it. You go. That's it. All right, let's give it one, one more spin. spin. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh so come so on! Close. Let me tie about pizza. We need to know. Wait, wait, wait. I need to know because pizza. Like, I once met someone who said they didn't like pizza, and I did judge them for it. <laughs> I was like, now my other thing is, I don't believe pineapple should be on pizza. I love pineapple okay, pizza. Okay, I know someone else who's pitched to me. He's like, listen, pineapple on pizza is great. You just haven't had the right pineapple on pizza. I'm like. I'm sorry. It's breaking my heart. What's <laughs> happening? I'm no, sorry. it's cool. It's cool. I'm sorry. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Well, thank you so much thank for stopping you. by. Thank you so much. That was fun. I'm glad I got pizza. <laughs> kind of. And I'm going to go get pizza. Well, I'm in LA. I'll wait till I'm back home. <laughs> sorry. <laughs>
I'm gonna get. Well, I'm, you're gonna. You're I'll gonna, tell you a pineapple place. Okay. A pineapple place. A pineapple pizza place. That a pineapple has. place where they serve pizza on the side. <laughs> Perfect. Hey guys, make sure to like and comment and watch the next video.